Hey everybody, this is Sasha with Goalie. I spend all day designing apps for kids and I love electronics. So we're gonna do a little series where we review phones designed for kids. Today, we're doing TruMe. T-R-O-O-M-I, TruMe. They make a phone specific for kids that parents can control. We're gonna check it out, unbox it, do all the stuff. Let's see how it looks. All right, so this beautiful box comes with uh, a nice message. Yay, it's here! And then it says, uh, hey, you can become anything you wanna be. So nice little box. Inside this box was another box. This one's for a Samsung Galaxy A14 with 5G. So these guys are repackaging um, a Samsung phone and then they've got some software on there that gives parents the ability to manage it from their phone, or from a web browser actually. Not much else in the box. I kind of thought there'd be more in there, but instead uh, it was a pretty simple little manual that said, go here. So I go there in my web browser, and I opened up this app for parents, and uh, I signed up, took like, I don't know, five minutes to activate, maybe less. No, it took like 30 seconds to activate, so it was really easy. And this is the phone itself. So you can see, here's my hand for scale. It's kind of a big phone. Here's my iPhone for scale. So it's bigger than an iPhone 13 Pro. Um, on Amazon right now, these are about 200 bucks, which is, which is what we paid for the phone too. So I don't think TruMe marks up the hardware. I think they're just reselling the hardware and then they make their money on the subscription that comes with the uh, mobile plan. When you open it, it's like really basic. It's just like an empty Samsung type of screen. And then in the web browser through the parent portal is where you can add apps. Now, I was a little bit confused at first because I was like, all right, I'm gonna try calling myself. So I hit the dial button and um, there, there were no numbers in here. The only number in here was 911. And so I was like, well, hold on. There's no dial pad. How am I supposed to call people? You have to add each contact on your phone. Those are the only numbers that are allowed to call in or out of your kid's phone. So big on safety. I think the way they do this is they have this TrueMe app installed on here and it's like a corporate phone. You know how like maybe if you work for a big corporation, they control everything that's on here. And in turn, you control everything in the parent portal. The phone itself is pretty lightweight. I mean, the screen's nice. It, you know, it feels like a $200 phone. I don't think there's anything like crazy about it. It's a nice touch screen. The, the camera is kind of basic, right? But like for a kid to take some really basic pictures and video, it's great, right? Here's me, whoa, camera and camera. Does that work? That's trippy, huh? But again, like if I take a, a picture, I can't just like send it to anybody. I can only send it to the people on my contacts list. So I guess if you're worried about sexting or any, any inappropriate conversations, they've got that under control. My colleague just told me a secret. Anything your kid sends from here, even if they delete it, you can still see in the parent portal. So it looks like you've got some good oversight, big brother. I did try adding a few apps and honestly it was easy. Like I added Google Docs and um, it only took, you know, like a few seconds on my phone. They did have some really scary <laughs> warnings like, oh, this, this app isn't checked by us and make sure your kids are old enough and that kind of thing. So it seemed like there was a lot of legalese and I didn't really understand why there had to be so much, but um, it worked, like the tech works. I think if you're looking for a basic phone for your kid, that's gonna protect them from doing wacky stuff. This is it. Like if you need them to be, just be able to communicate with you and, and a handful of family members, then this is it. If you wanna like pre-approve which friends they can text, this is it. At the time of recording, we paid $200 for the phone and then we paid $30 a month for the subscription to use the telco service. We didn't really test how good the telco service is because I'm pretty sure they're just buying AT&T or T-Mobile towers and yeah, like there, it doesn't really make sense for us to go like, hey, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Uh, I'm pretty sure they're just using a service that's not different from the one on my phone. I think this solves the problem that a lot of parents are having. My only complaints about it are, it didn't come with a case. I wish they would have included a case and a screen cover because I'm terrified of dropping this in the review. We still got to return this, right? So um, I wish it came with a case, but you can buy a lot of cases on Amazon. And I wish they didn't really like nickel and dime us so much. They, they charged us an activation fee. They charged us a shipping fee. And I kind of get the sense like when I'm adding apps, they're also kind of like nickel and diming us, not that because they're charging for apps, 
but it's like, oh, there's like one more thing that you need to be aware of. And it's really just kind of like legalese to protect them. But overall, it's a good product, right? Like I don't have any issues with the way they package this. I think it's smooth and most importantly, it works, right? I think your kid's gonna have a functional phone and that's probably what you need when you're getting one of these. If you don't want your kid, you know, like texting strangers, this helps. If you don't want your kids spending money or downloading apps, this will definitely do it. And if you don't want your kid accessing certain apps at certain times a day, this will also do it. Families that are worried about impulse control or something like that may find this useful. Also, if you're worried about safety and your kids are doing some naughty stuff on their phones, this will prevent that. That's why you might want to get a Tumi, but let me tell you why you might want to get a Goalie. This is it right here. Big, nice tablet that's gonna teach your kid practical life skills. Do your kids need help with executive functioning, like getting ready in the morning, or maybe brushing their teeth and some hygiene skills, or they've got some emotional regulation issues they wanna deal with. Goalie is the tablet that helps them practice those skills and also learn them. We've got a big pile of video content that's interactive so they can learn. How do I shake hands? How do I make mac and cheese? All those skills we teach on Goalie.